to the ProSociate Overview Screencast. The purpose of this demonstration is to do a walkthrough of the major features of ProSociate. Please see our other videos at ProSociate.com or our YouTube channel for detailed tutorials and training. ProSociate is a WordPress plugin that works in conjunction with the free WooCommerce plugin to create Amazon affiliate commerce sites of all types. ProSociate is designed to be the most complete plugin for Amazon Associates. No add-ons, no upsells, no magic, just good solid software. It's easy to use for beginners and robust for experienced users. You can quickly and creatively search all of Amazon products for your storefront or niche website. ProSociate has the most granular searching, allows you to import and export products, converts selected Amazon products to WooCommerce products, and automatically updates your pricing and quantity. You can even set automatic feeds of products from Amazon by your criteria. Let's go ahead and take a look. Here we are in the WordPress backend and viewing the Pro Associate menu options. Let's first look at the post products area, as this is the, really the heart of the software. There are two kinds of campaigns you can create. A standard campaign lets you search Amazon's entire product repository by category, price range, discount level, brand, and more. You can then select all or some of these products to be added to your site. A subscription campaign uses the same powerful searching capability, but it creates a feed of matching products that's automatically updated for you. For example, you want all items in your niche category that match a certain keyword and are greater than 80% off. A subscription campaign will give you a fresh stream of products that match that search criteria. But let's go ahead and look at a standard campaign and how that's set up. In the general search area, you see it's where you select your browse node or your category. And you simply can go in and select categories and subcategories. You can select keywords, titles. In the advanced search area, you can have minimum prices, maximum prices, Amazon only products, search by percent off, by brand, even by condition, use, collectible, etc. Very, very powerful, very robust searching. In addition to searching the millions of products at Amazon, we've created a dedicated book searching capability. It makes sense. Almost every site will have relevant books and ebooks. Why not create a library and be the go-to place for information about your niche? Just another way to attract relevant consumers to your website and ultimately onto Amazon. This dedicated book area lets you search by keyword, by title, by language, by subject, even publisher and publication date. It's really a powerful capability. In the optional settings area, you control how items are actually posted on the website. You can select post dates, you can select categories to assign them to that you've previously created. You can let us auto-create categories for you. And then there are two types of products that you create that are actually very different. The simple variable product is that add to cart product. It allows the user to have multiple items in a local shopping cart and then check out at Amazon. These items will benefit from a 90-day cookie for your commissions. External products, on the other hand, external products have a See More button and link the user directly to the Amazon product. But they also can redirect them to the same place on one of 10 other Amazon country locations. So for instance, if your user is in Mexico City and he looks at an item on your website and he clicks on the link to Amazon, he'll be taken and sent to Amazon.com to Amazon.mx. You can also change the post author, you can enable text spinning to rewrite the descriptions, and you can do things like assign a name to the uh, campaign so that you can manage and find it later. Okay, I think we've covered all the major settings and optional settings for posting. Let's go ahead and do it. So we'll go back to the general area and let's choose a category of gourmet food and something fun. We'll try to find ourselves some edible bugs. Now I know that the page I want this to appear on is just looking for all the WooCommerce products that belong to the category food. So I simply assign it like that. And I'll go off and tell Amazon what I'm looking for. I'm going to search the millions and millions of products there and it found a whole bunch, I found a hundred edible bugs. We'll just choose these first two and have it go off and uh, make those product posts for us. It's going to bring all the graphics, all the reviews, all the description information, any variations that are there for a product, and it's going to import those for us. Now we're going to end up putting those on our demo site, Evertrav, 
and here we have a food section and you know one of the nice things about ProSociate is it works with any WooCommerce theme which is pretty much every theme so in this case we're using Divi which is great it's easy to use in this case it was very easy to set up a Pinterest styled infinite scroll kind of capability um, and it's a plug and I mean it's a drag and drop sort of uh, back end so anyone can build a site with this thing let's see how it did here uh, yeah 95% it's just tidying things up so I happen to know that it will be available to us and I'll refresh this page and hopefully our new products have uh, have arrived uh, for our customers and there they are so these two new products and interesting this one has some variations so let's take a look at that so here we can select the options uh, what kind of option bugs could you have uh, scorpions cricket powder plenty of water scorpions tarantulas wow well it also brought in the descriptions of each one and it brought in the reviews so that's standard campaigns here's the subscription campaign as I said it's very similar the real difference is we're going to create a feed of products for you so the optional settings are the same um, if we search the exact same category it was grocery and food and bugs and simply add, I don't want a hundred items. I'm really looking for a very select group of uh, unique items that I can constantly be updating. So I'm going to say things that are at least 75% off in this case. And uh, it should find fewer, I would hope. Yeah, one, two, three. So it's like six of those. So that would be perfect for a, like a deep discount area of my edible bug section in my niche. I would just simply say I want to create these product posts and it would immediately post those five or six items, whatever here, but then it will constantly be finding new products at Amazon that match that criteria. Subscriptions give you that set it and forget it portion of your affiliate site. Coupled with the curated and managed products you personally select with the standard campaigns, you can present the best and most relevant content. We found all those products for you and posted them to your WordPress backend. Where did they go and what can we do with them? Well, remember, all products, all items that you bring in from Amazon become WooCommerce products that are then available to be used on your website. Let's go ahead and look at one of these products, these edible insects that we imported. And here you'll have the description pulled directly from Amazon. The images are pulled directly from Amazon. We do give you an additional field. We give you the ability to overwrite the product description. For many, many applications, this makes a lot of sense. If you're doing a top 10 or a best of or one of these sort of uh, comparison or review sites, which rank very well, you need your own content. Amazon's content is not going to rank for you. Alternatively, you can look at rewriting the article with a text spinner. This works for certain applications. Um, we have both this built-in spinner, which comes with the product, and we integrate with Spin Rewriter and other third-party spinners that you can license separately. So here they are in WooCommerce. How does WooCommerce get these products on the page? There are a number of ways to use the products you brought into the WooCommerce system from Amazon. Your theme will likely have a shop page or shop module. These theme-specific modules will let you easily include your entire shop or categories of your products. Even a theme like Divi, a drag and drop type of back end uh, allows you to have a shop module. So in this case, just simply displaying the products with no extra formatting or text. I have recent products. I've got a category of products. And that's very straightforward in Divi. You simply use the shop module in the Divi Builder. Just drop it right in there. And you tell it the type. In this case, I wanted recent products, how many posts, columns, sorting information, etc and the second one the food category one I simply made a product category told it 12 posts and six columns and selected just the food category and your theme is going to have some sort of shop module if it's WooCommerce compatible theme and a, and a shop focused theme you can also just use WooCommerce shortcodes these are really powerful you can put them in posts you can put them in pages so let's say I had a post that was uh, an article about great backpacking destinations. And I just wanted to have a little thing at the bottom that had these four products that I wish I had taken with me on the trip. Very easy to include using a WooCommerce shortcode. So if we look at this post and scroll down, apologies for the long post, 
we'll see I have this product IDs equal. And that's a WooCommerce shortcode. It's going to call these four products. We just look those products up in the product database there. And um, it, there you go. It's going to display those four products. And WooCommerce has a number of shortcodes available. Recent products, featured products, individual products, groups of products, categories. Uh, very, very flexible. Now, the third way you can include WooCommerce products or your Amazon products is with a third party, a third party plugin. So in the case of Evertrav, we wanted that little Pinterest style layout with the uh, infinite scroll. So we found a, uh, we worked with them before, a nice plugin vendor who has a masonry grid, it's the name of the plugin, a masonry grid layout and a template that allows us to add these extra elements like the Pinterest pin it in the email. And if we look at how that's set up, again, very straightforward. Let's edit one of these really quickly. Okay, here we are in food and beverage. We just give it a name. We tell it the product category that it, it, it's made up of, how many columns wide we want it to be, the label for it, and we can even include specific items as we want. Very straightforward. And then we have a, another short code, just different, different flavor, WMLS. And if we look in here and we edit this page, we'll see this page simply has a call to that shortcode. Here, and there it is. And that's the whole page is made up of that one little shortcode that calls all those IDs. So WooCommerce integration is the key advantage of the Pro Associate system. There are really a number of benefits to using WooCommerce. First of all, it's stable, there's a large install base, it's scalable, it's reliable. In addition to presentation-focused plugins like Masonry Grid, there's a whole world of plugins available to you. Wish lists, sliders, a huge range of options in the WooCommerce ecosystem. And thirdly, developers and front-end assistants, they're easy to find. Everyone knows how to work with WooCommerce if they're a coder or a front-end person. So they're going to, there's a large community of skilled workers, and a large community means competitive pricing as well. So WooCommerce is a key differentiator in using ProSociate. The settings area contains many functional components. In the general tab, your Amazon keys are stored for your default country. The geotargeting tab stores your international keys for the 10 other countries that we support. The compliance area manages timestamping of pricing and other Amazon terms of service items. The advanced tab is where many options are managed. Updating of pricing, quantity information from Amazon, what should be done? Should you say that remove the unavailable product or should you mark it as out of stock and leave it there? Do you want to use remote images? Remote images allow you to use Amazon's cloud service to store the images and you just manage links. Many of the advanced options are here, how your products are going to be updated, things like that. Requirements are simply the uh, current status of your system and tech spinning is if you were enabling Spin Rewriter or another third party spinning tool we'll manage the keys in there. The additional areas of Pro Associate include the thesaurus area where you manage the built-in text spinning that comes with the software, the product import area where you can uh, bring in a file of Amazon ASINs, those are like the product numbers in Amazon, bring in thousands of files but still control how you post them. The product stats area gives you information about your products and how they're selling, how many times they've been redirected, how many times they've been added to a cart, this type of information. And in manage subscriptions and manage campaigns, you can edit your campaigns and otherwise take control of them. Well, that's our Pro Associate walkthrough. I hope you found it informative. One uh, actual final thing I'd love to show you is um, if you think back to that Evertrav application, uh, the website with the food Pinterest styled layout, those work really best um, when there's multiple sources of content, right? So let's go ahead and see if we can find some eBay content for that site. I don't think they're going to have bugs, so I'm going for travel flavoring. Maybe we'll get some spices or something like that. Uh, Dramamine, okay, let's try this Thai snack here. Um, again, I've got to remember I want to put it in my category food. Okay, and that should be it. Now it's going off to eBay. 
grabbing that product, posting it for us. This is that food page here. And we should have a new product from eBay. There it is, and we link on this one. It's gonna take us over to eBay to purchase that and get another commission. Thanks again for watching the Pro Associate walkthrough and good luck with your online ventures.